My name is Niall Smith. I'm the Managing Director of Interlux Systems and Interlux Ireland. Interlux Systems is a, an established glazing company specialising in high quality energy efficient windows. Uh, we cover the whole of Ireland and we have showrooms in both Galway and Fermanagh. I've been an Internorm distribution partner for 11 years. Internorm's engineering and manufacturing the material used and the high quality, coupled with the contemporary style, made it a no-brainer. The property is located in a small village just outside of Monaghan Town. The client's brief was quite specific with this project. Barry was retrofitting a 1970s bungalow. Thermal performance was the most important aspect of this uh, particular build as uh, it had to meet Passive House uh, certification. Barry chose the KF410 Home Pure range, which is the UPVC aluminium system, and then the front door was done in an AT540, which is an aluminium system. My name is Dr Barry McCarn, and I'm the current chairperson of the Passive House Association of Ireland. Um, I'm an architectural technologist by trade, and um, I'm currently head of business and industry support at Southwest College, which is a further education college in Northern Ireland. For us, the windows were very, very important because with the Passive House standard, be it the retrofit Passive House standard, which is called Enerfit, or, or just Passive House Classic, there's five key principles, and those are really good levels of insulation, and then at the junctions or the details of the building, your second principle would be dealing with thermal bridging. The third principle is, is windows, and four and five would be you build airtight so as to mechanically ventilate. So that's the five principles. So when it come to choosing windows, it was a critical decision, and we put a lot of time and energy and thought into it. And um, when it come to Internorm, uh, the, they're, they're a premium product, but also with this, they're a high performance window. Um, when we looked at elements like the U-value of the frame, the U-value of the window itself, the, the U-value of the glass, and, and importantly as well, the G-value of the glass, all of these parameters were very, very suitable um, for Passive House. And we also really liked uh, the design of the window. We went for this KF410, which is an alu-clad PVC window. So um, both in terms of aesthetics and performance, we got the perfect balance. We're really happy with the outcome and building to the best standard that we could. And I'd encourage people to follow us. For us on the project and, and for me being a Passive House certified designer, it, it wasn't critical that the windows actually had Passive House certification, um, component certification. What was more important was that the company were literate with respect to the metrics that are required for Passive House certification. And with Internorm, that's the case. And then when we look at the temperature performance, our old kitchen, which used to be here, had an average temperature of 16 degrees. Um, the, since we moved in, the house is sitting at a lovely equilibrium of about 21, 22 degrees. It has never once crossed 25. One of the lovely things that I'm noticing um, from we moved in is we've quite deep window sills because of the retrofit. This is the thickness of the old wall. And, and for us, our, our kids love sitting in the windowsill and, and it's because of the comfort of the window. Um, from a passive house point of view in the building physics, when you have a triple glazed window that's well installed with a good U-value and, and, and U-value of the frame, what you, what you end up with, uh, on the, even with te minus 10 degrees outside, the surface of that glass being 16 degrees, which is considered thermal comfort, so we're well above that at this time of the year and, and you can see that with the kids migrating towards the window ledge and sitting in it and playing with Lego and different things. So, yeah. So we had a house that was very, very temperamental previously, but now we have a house that's very stable and is performing really well and is also very healthy. Mm -hmm.